absolutely no objections. Understand the pain you cause with your selfish misdirections. Hello, hello, hello. Here we are once more with Katty Rothberg. Hello, my love. How are you? I'm always happy when I'm here with you. Oh, I am too. So what's going on in the life of Glamorous, Patricia? Well, um, I've been working on editing my first book, which is called Extra Awesome. Oh, my. So is it an autobiography? It's an autobiography. It started out as like a sort of Joe Blow normal Patty Rothberg autobiography, which is actually sort of a contradiction in terms because my life has been so fabulous and, and nutty. Uh, and it had, but it had, you know, photos from 96 when I had my big record deal. Mm -hmm. and which then, was? Uh, between the one and the nine. Yes, which people are probably still buying. Yeah. Yeah. Some people are somewhere. Well, it's out of print, so it's, you know, I, I, I do. But online. Is it, you can get it online. Yeah. You can get it at Amazon. Everything's online. Yeah, don't be so humble. That was a huge, yeah, huge right. phenomenon. You were, Dude, I kicked major butt. You did. <laughs> and you had a major thing going on. I had major label butt. And you still have people that love you the same amount. I hope so. Well, I, I don't, when your name I don't comes up anyone. in a conversation, mm -hmm. everybody goes like, oh, Maybe Patty Rosberg? If I took my glasses off, I'd see that. It's true. But, um, you a lot of times so I just, I go, I go to work or I go, you know, like, for example, I'm editing my book in New Jersey and then I go home to Harlem and I don't see anyone. But so you are. I feel very alone, but I know there's people out there who. Oh my God, love people me worship you. People freaking love you. And I'm so lucky I get to see you play again tomorrow night at Smith's Tavern. We're doing a yes. little thing. Oh, and uh, yeah, she's an eight. Because like uh, I don't know how to get there. Well, you'll, you can come with us if you want. Okay. Um, it's easy. But besides that, so you are a musician, yes. a painter, now an author. I am an author. What else? Um. What don't you do? I don't know. Maybe do you know how to cook? <laughs> no, I actually have a fear of cooking. Is that right? Yes, I can't cook anything that had eyes or like a brain. Okay, I, that's I don't fair. Have a brain. <laughs> yeah, that's fair. So, yeah. do you, what did you eat today? Um, today, I had a fruit. What do you call it? A California salad. Fruit and veg. Very nice. cheese, which I'm told has a lot of protein. Yes, it does. That's and I'm, I'm really, really hungry, so after this, I'm totally going to... Well, it is Vanilla yeah. Fudge Day, so do you... Uh, wait, wait, wait. No, skeleton. Skeleton. You got a skeleton? Oh, I need that though. Is that how Yeah, it's like, you know, we, we, we oh, reward boy. you for telling us something deep. All right, let me see a skeleton. Well, <laughs> I... I'm starting to doubt if any of my male friends are platonic anymore. Oh, you Any should be your doubting male that. Friends male friends are never That's something that every, now, every woman hey. should know that. Wait, did yeah. you have a yeah. here? It's not true. I'm going to tell you that. Eat, you made a lot. So listen to me. I'm confused about that. Did you ever read The Celestine Prophecy? Did you ever read that book? Long time yeah, ago. A long time ago when it was big, right? Yeah. The one thing that stands out in my brain about that book was he said, platonic relationships are the only ones that are real. And it was like, he was going through that, like that book was like a double book, you remember? It had yeah. the message and then the story. Mm -hmm. I just remember that, that that's the line that like walloped me. Mm -hmm. Like, yeah, because when the other stuff comes, it messes everything up. That's true. So the platonic relationships. So, uh, so Patty had a very yeah. interesting yeah. Facebook status update. Yeah, what was um, that? And she said, uh, and I don't know if I've ever really responded to your status updates. Like, I always read them, and I always enjoy reading what you're doing. But she said something like, um, how come it's the people that we share the most intimate parts of ourselves that we end up blocking on Facebook? Oh, is that what you do? That was so I don't even know how to block it. down Facebook philosophy. How do you block someone? I'm, like, lame like that. I mean, I am a slut on Facebook, but I didn't That's so true. In each case... Um, I only blocked two people, and they actually, they're both ex-boyfriends, and they both sort of look exactly now, wait, like me. So wait a minute. Wait, I just have a question. You just don't defriend them? You block them? Like, can't you just cut them off? Like, I don't like do you just keep them, them as a friend In and each block case, I them? Just, I like, desperately figured out how to do it and just, like, fuddled around. And I'm just confused. Are you still friends with them on Facebook? I'm not friends with either one of them. So you are you so defriended. And blocked. It's, I, I it's feel like it's a symbolic thing. Like, like the other day, it's I like went that. and blocked like guys that I haven't seen in ten years. So it's always like everybody that I 
Yeah. So I'm it's not, not. So it's always those non-platonic men. Yeah. But you did it for you. I did it for They me. don't know that you they don't know. know. It's oh, really they don't know. Sanity. So they don't know. They don't know. So there's no warning for them that you are blocked. Oh wait, you know what? They do know. <laughs> yeah, because if they search you, they won't see your photo. Like they'll go look at so the someone. So I could be they blocked get a from somebody else. Message of you. So I could be blocked from someone if I look to be their friend. I can't. Exactly. Is that it? Exactly. I'm going to have to check that out. And I also blocked them so that I wouldn't go looking at their profile pictures. Oh, because you were too tempted to because go. Because it actually, snoop. like, screws me up, like, if they get married, Facebook. I'm like, oh, yeah. Facebook. Yeah. All right, we're going to come back and hear you sing a song. Okay. Because I, I need to hear you. Cool. All right, we'll be right back. Room on Blocking you. Like a victim of supreme depression. And you 